Leatherback sea turtles are amazing creatures. Their life cycle starts with a mother turtle crawling up the beach shore to lay her eggs. She digs a nest and lays around 50 to 200 ping pong sized eggs. After she finishes, the mother turtle covers the nest in sand and returns to the ocean. The buried nest protects the eggs from predators, keeps the eggs moist, and helps maintain a proper temperature. Around 70 days later, the eggs hatch and the baby turtles crawl out of the nest. Unfortunately, 20% of the eggs will never hatch. The baby turtles now have to face the dangers of the beach before reaching the water. Predators such as crabs, seagulls, and raccoons roam the shores to pick off the easy target and vulnerable babies. However, once in the ocean, they are exposed yet again to sea predators such as dolphins, sharks, and large fish. To counter this, they take shelter in floating seaweed or debris until they grow older. The Sargassum seaweed is a perfect nursing home for these babies as it provides camouflage and shelter. The baby turtles will then feed on small crustaceans, larvae, fish eggs, and even the seaweed. As the young leatherbacks grow larger, they begin migrating away from their tropical birthplaces towards cooler waters looking for jellyfish feeding grounds. Their scissor-like beak is perfectly suited for tearing and sharp spines in their mouth and neck, called papillae, help move prey into the stomach. After years of feeding, the turtles can eventually grow to become 6 feet in length and weigh over 2,000 pounds. At this stage, the turtle is safe from most predators. However, plastic bags can easily be mistaken as food, and eating them will lead to death. Ocean pollutants can poison the water, while nets and debris can also entangle the turtles. Finally. Once reaching maturity, the mother turtle journeys across the sea, returning back to where she was born. And thus, the cycle continues.